my training from the ancient mystics. However, I grew up on the streets. What you will be witnessing today is a freestyle rap tarot reading in an attempt to interpret your personality entirely in rhyme format. Select one, anyone. Select one and I will tell you. It is the, it is the four of wands. Do not think that this is all perpetrated by morons. The four of wands, in fact, will tell you which planet you're on. What is your name? Esther. Esther. In this tarot reading, Esther, I'm about to give you the best of what I've got and try not to act like a jester. So I'm going to test you by not just acting like a retard and putting out three cards. The four of wands says that the planet you're on predicts instead four cards. I'm giving a reading that you're hard. <laughs> <laughs> Don't look very happy. You're skeptical that you're staring at me. That's all right. The second card is about to emerge, which I will attempt to awkwardly bring into reality with words. Your pick. The Nine of Cups. I'm getting a reading off you that you're thinking that my rhyming sucks. <laughs> Indeed, though, Nine Cups is not an indication that we are part of a freak show. I am getting a vibe coming through possibly this wire that it is a representation of wishes and desires. Yes, it's a strange thing, but you are now wishing that this experience was more entertaining. <laughs> Which means I'm infiltrating your brain. Think. Do you realize that that might be true or not true? I'm not going to play like the previous guy did and pretend that at this very moment I want you. <laughs> I'm going to say that um, later, after Nine Cups, you will be slightly less sober, and then I would have a much greater chance of winning you over. <laughs> it's time for the third card, which is going to be the penultimate, and it's not my fault what you pick. This is the Five of Coins. I'm trying not to make this as sexual as the previous one and only talk about my loins. <laughs> but the feeling I am getting from the Five of Coins is coming from my groin, so I am going to enjoin you to attempt to explain how this concern and complexity card has been designed to test whether this is very difficult and hard. I'm just like a junkyard dog barking up in the yard, playing kind of gangster. Thanks for your skepticism. <laughs> filled with happiness instead of anger. Mm. I'm seeing that you're slightly warming to me, although not all there yet. The fourth <laughs> card will bring us through, okay? The fourth card will bring us through. This is the person that I'm singing to. I'm thinking it's you. Does it represent you? Yes, it does. It's a raccoon. <laughs> <laughs> What are the chances something I came up with in my mind that pulled out the car and it fucking rhymed? <laughs> Indeed, the time before. This one says that you will persevere and endure. I didn't think that this thing about rhyming words would really work, but it seems to have uh, brought some elements of your personality out in verse. So uh, if you think that I've done well with my search, then I hope you give us a better score than verse. <laughs>